Hi guys, welcome to this session on Google Mail Merge. In this module I want to show you how you can merge address details from a Google Sheet into a Google Doc to create a mail merge. So on the screen you've got your letter. Now if I go back, this is called main letter, if I go back into the home area and then select the menu and pick up sheets, I'll just show you the sheet that I'm going to use. This is called Data Source Google, and there's a list of all the addresses that I'm going to merge with a letter, including emails, and I'll do an email merge after I've done this one. So if I go back into the main area, back to Docs, and then open up that letter, which was this one, main, le main letter. What I need to do is First of all, if you've never done this before, you need to go to add-ons and you need to add mail merge. So you go get add-on and then select mail merge. And then this will give you this option and we're going to use the start option at the top there. So what it does, it looks for the last sheet that you had open, which in our case was that Google's data source document, which you can see there. So that's linked it to this document. And then it's a case of inserting the fields from that document wherever you want them. So I want the title field and then add. So then it inserts the code at the top. I need to do a space. Then I want the surname, surname add. So it'll insert surname. So those are the two fields there. And then I come down and I just go through this and add the fields that I want to appear in my letter. So adding the address coming down and I'll add the city and I'll stop at the city but obviously you'd go through the postcode and all of that other stuff that you might want now there I want to have dear first name so if I change that to first name and then add you have your fields in the correct place and you might want to get rid of any blank spaces that you don't want and then you type your letter and then you're ready to do the merge. So down the bottom you have these options. We're not doing email, we're doing letters. So I want to merge this letter. It comes up at the top saying, you have 15 letters to merge, do you want to continue? Yes, I do. And then it'll start the merge process. And it could take a couple of minutes depending on how many letters you've got. And then once it's finished, it'll come up with a link that you can click on to complete the merge. There it is. So if I click that, you can check that this has done the merge correctly. So you can see Mr. Brown, there's the address, dear Steve, so Steve Brown. And then if you go down, you've got a letter per person in the list, and there should be 15, and there is 15. So you can see that that works quite well, and that's a simple merge to a letter. Now if you wanted to do the email, if I go back into the main area and I'll just um, pick a blank document this time, but I still want to do a mail merge, but this time it's going to be to an email, so I'm going to email things. So you go back to add-ons, mail merge, and then you've got these different options again, but I'm going to go start and then it will pick up the same list but this time, um, it's given me this default text. I'm not, too, I'm not too interested about this default text. If you started with a blank paper, that's what happens. If you start with a letter that's already got text on, you saw what happened before. It's picked up the list. Um, you've got email settings now, look. So email to email. So the field is called email. So it's picked that up. And you can see that. And basically what you can do is do a test email so if I do a test email to the first one and then merge it should send an email to the first record now test email was successfully sent to that address so I'll close that and then now I need to go and have a look at that so if I go back into the main area and find um, my, my Gmail, so I need to go over to these ellipses. So we're going to Gmail. I should see a letter coming in. 
at the top. Dear Mr. Last Name. There you go. So they sent the email. I never filled that information in, but that just proves that that works. And everybody on that list, once you fill the letter details, will get an email. So that's two looks at how to do a mail merged letter in Google and then how to do a mail merged email in Google. So that's all I want to talk about in this little video. So hopefully that was of use and thank you for your time and I'll see you in the next one.